Um, hello and welcome to this tutorial. I know the audio is kind of crap, but it's really the best I can do, so I hope you understand it anyway. Okay, so in this tutorial I'm going to show you how to make uh, the graphene effect or the multi-layer masking effect. It was discovered by Ilrel recently, so I used it in my new level graphene. Um, the effect consists of three parts. There's the bottom pattern, there's the top pattern, and then there are the in-between blocks. So first off, the bottom pattern is a pattern that consists of two different colors. Um, throughout the level, I just used the background as one color, and then I put some blocks on top, which are these, for example, um, just some uh, vertical lines. So the bottom pattern is very simple. The top pattern is way more complicated. It actually, it also consists of two colors, one color on the left and one color on the right. But each of these two colors also consists of two colors. And it's when you put these colors together, then you, uh, you get the real magic because these two colors are actually the same when you just look at them like this. But because this is dark on this side and this is bright and because these are above these then you get the effect that when you put something in between these two then you start to see these two colors so right now i just made some uh, horizontal lines with the same like like this for example if i wanted to make a checkerboard pattern i would just take these two and so you just um, remember that this is one color and this is another color. So if I wanted to make a checkerboard pattern, this is what I do. But right now you can see that this is a checkerboard. But once you take the in-between blocks, which are C minus 5, and these are C minus 4 and minus 6, you put them in between these two layers. And therefore you start to see the checkerboard pattern, just like that. So really, um, the top pattern is invisible until you put some in-between blocks, then you can start to see it. So for example, if I move these blocks over here, you can see the top pattern. But if I just had the top pattern on top of the bottom pattern, I wouldn't be able to see that it's there. So it's only when I put some in-between blocks on top that I can start to see the top pattern emerging. So that's basically the effect. And the hard thing about getting this effect right is really the colors. So you should just be thankful that I made all these colors already. Um, so you have three colors that, well, you have one main color. This is 65 for me, and it's around uh, the middle, but actually you can choose any color that you like. I just have it around here. And then you have seven more colors, and all these colors are copy color, and they copy color 65. And then they have some different values of saturation, brightness, and opacity. So for example, 66 has copy color 65, and then it has saturation times 0.48 and brightness times 0.66 and this goes on for these three colors and then these four colors um, down here do the same thing except their opacity is different um, so for example this 69 is 166 but only 0.25 in opacity so just be aware that these are different and these are of course the colors of the top pattern so it's possible to see through it. Um, so if you just make sure to copy all these and make them uh, the same as I did, you should be guaranteed to uh, make it work. Uh, if you also remember to make the C uh, layers right. So you have the bottom pattern, which is below everything over here. And you, then you have the top pattern, where you have a bottom part and a top part. And in between those are some some blocks. Um, so you can do uh, many things with the, this effect. Um, 
for example, all the effects that I did in Graphene uses this. Uh, the robot pad uses this exact um, setup, and I just rotate this to get a nice effect. So the main thing that is preventing you from making something spectacular is really the top pattern because you can't have any overlapping two colors. So you must choose a two pattern, a two colored pattern that doesn't use any overlapping blocks. But for example, just uh, horizontal lines or you could make triangles like I did at the drop or you can make uh, a checkerboard like I did here or some diamonds but really you can't have anything overlapping so the top pattern cannot consist of circles for example so that's the only thing that you really have to think about or else it can be many different two colored patterns and then you can just animate it in any way you like. For example, um, here I have one checkerboard and then I have the top pattern is also a checkerboard. You can't see it right now, but it is. And then I have the in-between blocks like this and this rotates around and creates a nice effect where you can see uh, the top pattern and the bottom pattern at different parts. So that's how to make the effect. If you want this to play around with you can because i uploaded graphene um, with this inside so you can just go copy graphene passes one two eight nine one two um, and you can just copy this if you want to make the effect yourself so that's basically it i hope you understood and um, see you next time bye